Dang. Oh. Uh, should we do it? What? I don't know. Should we do it? That's the music. Okay. Woo! <laughs> Tristan cannot hear this because he does not have headphones on. But ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the very first banger podcast with Brandon J. Tristan, Yap Tanko, Yappy Chuan Chuan, Yappy Fam, Yappy Solo, Jigging with Jordan, whatever you want to call us. But we are so thankful you guys are here with us on the Banger Podcast. Very first one. Wow. We, there's no turning back now. Yeah. We've been uh we've been talking about this for months. I'm nervous, dude. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm excited. All right, let's crack these open. All right, yeah. Cheers to uh the very first one. Cheers to being spending a lot more time together. Cheers to banging. <laughs> no, it crack it. I thought we were gonna. Oh, you want to do that? I mean, I don't want to do anything over okay. the soundboard. It's very expensive. Yeah, let's just let's do, do it. Do this. No, 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 no. Oh no! Don't crack it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. No. There we go. We crack it. Ah, nice. we live, baby. Okay. Wow. So, uh, yeah, very first podcast. How do you feel? I feel like um, I don't know. Dude, okay, so it's, first of all... Well, I, well, okay, so first of all, we only we only ordered one uh, headphones because we weren't we, sure what no, headphones was No, it was, was not we, bro. It was, I said, Tristan, Time out. headphones... I don't know what camera to look at right now. There's so many. <laughs> okay, so uh, the basically the story of the podcast is uh, something we wanted to do. I got to finish the headphone story. We're starting yeah. off so rambled, yeah. but... Uh, basically, to let you guys know, we have this beautiful soundboard here. Tristan has no <laughs> clue what any of this I sounds just, like. I just got here today. Because he doesn't have headphones. I yeah. told him, I was like, it's so important. He was like, dude, I don't want to wear headphones. I don't want these mics. He wants standalone mics. I really want my own just headphones. Just handhelds. Yeah. But anyways. So yeah, this is something that we've kind of been planning out, kind of been thinking about for the past... I would say six months. Me and Brandon have been talking about it. We've been just, actively planning yeah. like small parts of it. The desk was the longest part. Right. And then finally, like you were like, order the stuff, order the stuff, yeah. order the stuff. And I was like, yeah, I got it ordered. And I hadn't <laughs> even ordered it yet. <laughs> and then a month later, I actually ordered all the stuff and it was there in two, three days. And that was probably two weeks ago. And now you've been playing with it. We finally got Dude. all the mics. We yeah. have our first guest coming in. Dude, bang, well, banger Dude, guest. Yeah, banger guest. We can't even talk about the guest yet. No, but, but so let's give a little bit of backstory of why we called it the Banger Podcast. First off, the first to, uh, the first name was going to be Off the Deep End, but there's like 15 Off the Deep Ends on there's a bunch. every, everywhere. So one thing that you guys know is um, if you don't know us from the diving and treasure world is that we find GoPros and phones and guns and all we find kinds bangers. Of, we find bangers and that's what we call them. They we have find a nickname. something good. Yeah. It's called a banger. Yeah. And I don't know when that, that was probably four or five years ago that we came up with banger. Oh dude, I found a banger. Yeah. You know, and it's just a well-known term now yeah. in the treasure world. And by the way, this podcast is just going to be kind of just Tristan and I being besties and talking and <laughs> there, there's just so many stories that we have from over the past five to six years from college cheerleading oh God. youtube traveling teaming up with some of the freaking biggest youtuber groups we've got some stories it's interesting and i think we should dig into a couple stories on the pod yeah because i was i was kind of like curious as to what we we're going to start out with like what other than catching up, because we've we've been together for about three hours now. Four Actually, hours. have not seen each other since two thousand and twenty-one. Yeah, I think that's like accurate. My, my wedding? No, Jake's birthday. Okay, Jake's birthday. But we didn't even really get to spend that much time right. together. Anyways, we haven't caught up. So we haven't even caught up. So and we haven't been talking to each other while we've been we, here. We've been like, dude, there's this thing that, and I'm like, save it for the podcast. Save right it for the podcast. So. Um, but on a serious note, we just we're super excited. You guys are the only reason that we were able to even do this, to be able to buy all this equipment and you know what it was it exciting about it for us too? It's like TikTok's not really our thing. Yeah. YouTube is our thing. Yeah. Facebook is kind of our thing. But all of those are either a, like ten minutes. Ten to fifteen minutes. Yeah. And then the short form stuff is just you don't get, get to see who people are. Yeah. But podcasts have become popular. You and I have been on a lot of podcasts together. And we've had fun. So much fun. So this is something that's going to lengthen it out. You're going to really get to see mine and Brandon's personality working together that yeah. you'll never get to see. Most of our videos are, what's up, guys? We're doing this. Right. This is what we're using. Well, we're trying to make bangers. Yeah. And so a lot of the time. Banger podcast. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, here we are. 
<laughs> we're like, we still got to make bangers, but we want a podcast, banger podcast. But this is like the long form, but we just get to tell those crazy stories. Yeah. We get to take our time. We don't feel like, I mean, there's going to be a lot of times you might be able to tell that we're just going to ramble because this is what we've done for the past five minutes. Yeah. But there's going to be some really unique stories, really unique people that we're going to bring on here. And you're never going to believe some of this stuff that has gone down. Do you want to know my favorite part? What's your favorite part? This feels like we're reunited once again. Yeah, for a long time, me and Brandon, like... We lived together. We've lived together. For a long time. Dude, we've been through a lot of stuff together, but in the past year, I or golly, probably probably the past Everybody's two or three grown years. Up, dude. Yeah, everybody's kind of not split apart. We always come back and see each other and hang out, but there's been a little bit of a disconnect in the... We used to do everything together. <clears throat> so. Yeah, I mean, Tristan got married. <clears throat> I uh, moved to Florida. I bought a house. Yeah. So we're just like physically far apart. Yeah. But we're still best friends. I mean, gosh, we're talking on the phone every day for like yeah. two hours at a time. I think it, at one point you're like, dude, <laughs> stop calling me. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's like, I, I answered the I phone. I miss you. <laughs> I answered the phone today completely covered in bubbles for a uh, brand deal of like some soap stuff I was doing. I was like, Tristan, I am covered in bubbles right now. Can I please call you back? You're like, but I just want to talk. So what's weird is we're having a conversation there, obviously listening and watching, but I feel like I need to be looking at you. But right then, now? Yeah. You I feel like both. I need a camera over your shoulder looking this way. I can actually just film you with my phone. <laughs> <laughs> why didn't we Why didn't we get all that? What You guys don't know, but we have a fortress of tripods in front of us. There's one, two, three, four, five. There are six tripods in front of us. And a cameraman going like this behind them <laughs> and just checking them out. Um, but anyways, we're, we're going all over the place and I really don't know where this pod, this first podcast is going. Well, it's this is, this is getting all the bugs out. Well, it's pro part, part of the thing here. And not to mention, this is going to be the most raw that you've ever seen us probably. Well, I'm sure there's some videos out there of you particularly a little more raw than the podcast. The most raw <laughs> that Brennan's ever been. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> um, man, I'm excited. So... I have uh, some notes here on my phone just because I got nervous. And <laughs> we've also been planning this podcast for six months. So we've written down some pretty spectacular things. One of those on my phone, <clears throat> Tristan has no idea what I have in my phone, by the way. I really don't. So it, it's if you want to talk about this, but if you don't, totally cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Tristan and I have had some great times together. One of those great times, we went on a Texas tour. Very first time, Tacoma, pulling double jet skis. Blue Bay, the real Blue Bay. The one that got the stolen. One before it got stolen. The real Blue Bay. I don't know what you're about to pull out. And then we had the Red Rocket, I guess. What are you, do you have a name for yours? It's just my jet ski. Okay, cool. So Tristan and I... <laughs> You have no idea where I'm going. Are you nervous? No, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. We went to this beautiful place called Canyon Lake. Oh, you're talking about when I wrecked it? <laughs> oh, I no don't one, think this is public, right? No one knows about this. Okay, so this is a Banger Podcast exclusive. Yeah. Th and for a while, it never was on the internet because Jake, right? No, it wasn't necessarily Jake. It was just like, I was just going to get it fixed and... Here we are. Here we are. <laughs> <laughs> so this has been three years ago. Let me tell a little bit of, it, just me in general, I am such a bad pro procrastinator. And yeah. just put things off, put things off. I'm going to do it next week. The gear. You yeah. see the, the trend here? I bought the gear. Yeah, didn't buy the gear. Didn't buy the gear. Dude, I'm getting it fixed. <laughs> this is a $16,000 jet ski that, well, okay, keep going. It's It gets worse. Yeah. Here's Here's why I bring it up. First of all, this is a this is a great example of what you're going to get on the pod, because no one knows this story except for me and you and a few Kenzie. Jake, Jake and your wife. Yeah, right. Gosh, it's so weird saying wife. We've it really grown really, up. It really is weird. So weird. Oh. Uh, so great. Jake. No, weird. Jake came to me a long time ago, <clears throat> three years over three years ago. Yeah. Said Brandon. We hit this light goal on this video. I'm buying Tristan a wave runner. I'm like, what? God, there's mind so, you, it's so much deeper than that. But let's just keep but, going. But mind you, Jake had we hadn't blossomed yet. He was doing great. Yeah, 
he was doing like I, buy your friend a waiver and a great, yeah. but he's nowhere near where he's at now. I mean, yeah. dude's closing in on 13 million. But Tristan, he was probably getting a little bit better views back then. Yeah, I mean, well, <laughs> all, all, of all of us, us. right? <laughs> all of us, That's right? That's why we're starting the podcast. <laughs> oh, look how the truth has come to okay. service once again. Anyways. So, yeah, well, let's put a Band-Aid on that. We'll get into that a little we're bit later. Hurting. Look, Tristan uh, <clears throat> Tristan hit this light goal. Jake bought Tristan a wave runner. It was a big surprise. I was part of the plan. I had to, like, hide it and I do cried. all this stuff. Yeah, so it was super sentimental, the Wave Runner, and not only was it a gift, it was an expensive gift. Yeah. It was a YouTube eyes on you gift. Yeah. So many people still to this day is like, Jigging with Jordan. I'm like, what's up, man? They're like, we love when you gave that dude that Wave Runner. I was like, wasn't me, but I take the credit every time. Jake, if you're watching this, I'm sorry, <laughs> but thank you so much for making me look like a great well, guy. Well, okay. Yeah, it is hard because sometimes. <laughs> They do. People do mix us up. It's the camo wetsuits, bro. Yeah, it, they make they mix us up, and so then you just kind of go with it, so you don't make the fan feel or the subscriber. Oh, feel for sure. I mean, they sh they're showing you love. Yeah, you know, but they, you were in the video, <laughs> right? I was in it. So I, I, my wallet wasn't in it. Whatever they but say, I was I'm in Jake. It. I'm like, what's up, guys? How'd it going? Anyways, <laughs> but, long story short. Uh, there's a lot of money, a lot of sentimental moments. There's a lot of pressure on Tristan at this point. Yeah. So fast forward to the lake, uh, Tacoma days. Beautiful Del day. Yeah. We were in this spot. We were trying to spear carp and it was in awesome. like South Texas. Yeah. No, it's West Texas. Yeah. We were just making a whole tour out of it. And so Brandon was like, dude, I got to go crap. Oh, dude, I forgot yeah. about this. Yeah. You're like, dude, I'm about to crap myself. Dude, it was it was Red Bulls, tacos, just a mix. It was so, still to this day, one of the worst yeah. stomach on the and water moments I've suit. ever had. In oh, yeah. Suit. Oh, so yeah. So you run over to whatever. So I'm in this, like, imagine a forest <laughs> in a lake, but all the trees are dead. And so it's just beautiful. We're, you know, I'm looking, the water's clear, and I'm like, dude, I got to get out of these, out of this. Well, dude, to, I'm to gonna, paint the picture a little more, I mean, it's like, beautiful blue water yeah trees coming up out of it everywhere though. but, but it's deep it's like 40 50 foot deep yeah it's these deep trees water. are huge so and there's 40 feet of trees sticking out of the right water. they're huge anyway so i'm like dude i'm getting too far in i need to get out of here because i seen one that was under the water that someone had cut they had cut it right under the water i'm like oh that's not good yeah it's dangerous right? so i see a bass boat running about 40 50 miles an hour just through it and i was like well as long as i am that going, guy knows what he's doing that guy knows what he's doing <laughs> he's from here so i'm like i'm gonna follow him and i'll be fine so i'm just putting along like I'm, I'm still going slow because i know like something can come happen right but I'm going like 15 to 20 miles an hour, but I'm not up on plane. So the difference between me and the bass boat was the bass boat's sitting. If this is the water, he is just going yeah. right over when, the water. When you're on plane, you elevate yeah, quite a bit. I mean, he's literally sitting in four inches, five inches of water. Even though you're on a wave runner, yeah. you're still in the water a little bit because you're not up on plane. If but you would have been on plane. I think I would have been fine. You would have been or more out of the water than I would have flipped. No. <laughs> So anyways, there was one of those trees that had been cut about probably two feet under the water that I could not see. And so I'm just following right where that bass boat goes, and I just feel a boom, boom like this. Oh, it's never it Comes good. up, and I'm like, I, Kinsey's on the back of the jet ski. That's my wife. And I'm sitting there Wasn't like, at the time, though. No. It was Straight just girlfriend, girlfriend. Just girlfriend, girlfriend mode at, at the that time. time. And um, I look back, <laughs> and I'm like, oh, my God, that's not good. Let me ask you this. When you hit it, you obviously were like, oh my God, that's not good. I but were like, you like, I was like, we're I just sink. ripped at the bottom of my jet ski? Or I was were like, you just like, oh, that could be bad? I was like, this, this, this isn't good. <laughs> but it, I'm hoping, I'm hoping it's not that bad. Okay. So in my mind, I'm like, Brandon's not here. He can't save us. Luckily, we're close to the boat ramp. I was about to, that was my next question. Yeah. So I'm calling you. You're like about to shit your pants. So, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Let me take this over. Okay. I have a very makeshift like GPS unit on my oh, wave yeah. runner. I am not the type of dude who can just let a slushy go <laughs> out in the middle of the open. Because let me tell you, this was a slushy. 
Okay. Yeah, that's not good. That's not. That's never good. The cola slushy. That was me, but without the ice. Okay. Just right. <laughs> <laughs> so, <clears throat> if you guys know Canyon Lake, Lake Canyon, Lake Cannon, maybe I don't know. I don't if know. you're from Texas, you'll know. <clears throat> it's a pretty prominent lake, but it's big. It's beautiful. It's big. big. Uh, big. I found a marina, mm-hmm. so I flew to the marina as fast as possible and we're at 15 minutes we're yeah, crushing it right <laughs> t just looked at the time yeah 15 minutes crushing it so i flew to the marina as fast as possible dock my wave runner and i'm doing like the sideways waddle because i cannot Squeeze separate it. my legs oh, no. too far you're just please lord you know what's worse than having <clears throat> a belt on your pants Ooh. having a weight belt on yeah. your wetsuit that's a whole different device. so okay let's fast forward i'm in the stall finally like the pressure's off i made it i made it Ring. Ring. i'm like <laughs> what does tristan want answer it bro bro i could hear it in your voice the panic i was like you got the it. panic i was like dude you gotta get here you told me you were sinking my jet ski is sinking my jet ski is sinking Dude, I'm mid squirt, just so stoked that I finally made it. Do you you don't know what kind of fear goes through a man when he's trapped in his own wetsuit, seventy miles an hour in the middle of some random lake, and he's just following a purple little line on his GPS, just hoping it leads to the marina. I, you finally get I there. Think I know that feeling. No, because you would have just let her rip at the boat. <laughs> right You're a different animal. <laughs> T does not care. T uh, really does not care. But. So I, I was finally in this moment of like, ah, relaxation. And, you're like, and then panic struck once again. Now I got to go help my friend out who is, in my case, about to drown within the next 30 seconds. Yeah. Like that's the type of panic. I was scared. In your voice. As you should have been though. So, um, so we make it to the boat ramp and I grab my goggles and I'm like, dude, I, I'm like, please, Lord, let this not be this bad. Like, but, but mind you, you. I have the keys to the truck, which yeah. means I have the keys to the trailer. So you're literally just beached. Yeah, I'm going to beach it, and we'll figure it out afterwards. Right. Um, so I pull it up, pull my goggles on, look under there, big old hole. And I'm like, Ooh. no. Let's describe this hole. It's about, <laughs> you could fit a baseball in it. But, what? That's a big baseball, dude. Softball. You're, okay, yeah, I was going to say, dude, that's one hell of a baseball Softball. right there. So the softball can fit, it, but it's not like, I can't see, like if I were to open up, if you've ever seen a jet ski, I can't open up the seat and see the ground. Right. It's the like, it's right just there. like broken in fiberglass. Ooh. So I'm like, not good. Water in the... I'm thinking Titanic. But I mean, you're, you're safe because you're beached, but... Yeah, but I'm still, still panicking. Still bad. Um, so then you finally get there. You're like, what's going on? We finally get the trailer, back it up. And I'm just like devastated. Do you remember a slight problem we had with that? Putting it on the trailer? It's been a long time. I'll explain. Do you remember how incredibly steep that boat ramp was? Oh, you were slipping. I was having the Tacoma two wheel drive. Tacoma (sighs) two wheel drive. Never buy a two wheel drive truck. Unless it's it's your first YouTube check. Unless and you really need a you, truck. Unless you need a truck. And unless you're not going to be doing like outdoor stuff. That Anyways. was a that was an absurdly steep boat ramp. Let's yeah, be real. I, I really did forget about that. It was kind of hard to walk up. But long story short, yeah, we put second. it on there. It drained for a minute. Yeah, there was a lot of water. <laughs> but long story short, it's still sitting in my driveway. I am actually getting it fixed. I, I cannot believe you. Yeah, that's true. I can't believe you. I Hey, one day I'll get it fixed. <laughs> I, you know what sucks is like if you actually had it fixed right now, we could just go rip and do cool jet ski stuff. Yeah. Another thing, by the way, guys, I don't know. We should spoil it. There's no reason to pretend. There's no, there's no play play going on here. Wait, about the guest? <laughs> what? Who, no, who not about the about? guest. No, how you and I are going to film these podcasts. So you might be asking yourself, Brandon J. I don't know what he's about to say. Tristan Yaptenko, you guys live in different states. Oh. How, how are you going to do the pod, and how can we believe that we're going to get more than this? <laughs> You're going to get one episode. <laughs> Which you might. You really might. I have no idea. But this is kind of the plan. Tristan's going to come down to my house one week 
out of every single month, one week. We're going to film together during that week, so it'll be great. Like, it gets us together filming, going out, doing adventure stuff together. But also, every night, we'll be podcasting, which is so dope. So, we might not always be able to hit super relevant topics. Like, if something, like, for example, as we're filming this right now, like, maybe a couple days ago, John B. caught a 14-pound largemouth bass. Yeah. That is incredible. Yeah. But if we had already filmed last week and this happened like a week after, we wouldn't be able to talk about that till next month. Yeah. If that makes sense. Because our whole podcast for that month. Well, I mean, that's the plan right now. It, it might change. and You could buy a house in Florida. Yeah, but probably not. Um, but this, this is the, the plan right now is just to try to get a schedule, right? Yeah. To try to put out. What are we saying? Two two podcasts a week? That's where we're at. I mean, that's I what think, we're thinking. I think we can do that. I think it's super reasonable, but at the same time, guests are going to make it a lot easier. Yeah. Because then we could podcast super easy every single night. We're not running out of topics because yeah. then we're just running into people. And I feel like, I mean, we're 21 we're minutes, 21 minutes in, in and we've yeah. only talked about one topic. We have years of topics and that's what's kind of scary. That's why I'm looking at it like, should we move on to the next subject? I mean, what you got? And that's what I, I that's what another got, thing man? that we can kind of add in, in on here. If you're listening to it somewhere, I don't even know if we're able to, to do that yet, but that's we're going coming to. soon. This will be available on all streaming platforms, just maybe not when you're listening to yeah. it. Yeah. Soon. <laughs> Eventually. Soon, it will, soon you will yeah. be able to work out or drive and just listen to the podcast. But since you are watching it on YouTube right now, maybe not, I don't know. If you're watching it on YouTube right now, comment below, you know, how long you, if you want them longer. Do you want them 45 minutes? Do you want them an hour? That's what we're thinking. 45 minutes to an hour, maybe longer. But I think if we bring on a guest, I don't think I'm going to cut it short just because... No, for sure. We just got to let it roll. For sure. But... Cool. Uh, Next topic. All right. All right. Take a little break. Can we take a little... Are you going to take a break? Really? Man. How about we press one of these buttons over here? Should Should we press a button? Should we press a button? Set the tone? Do you want me to do the intro song again? By the way, we have no clue if we're going to get copyrighted for that. I've just been pressing that button. It's like a theme song. It's so much fun. Maybe we shouldn't do the, that button. But actually, let me ask you a question. It's been, let's just be real. It's been a long time since we saw each other. Okay. Like a long time. Yeah. It's been. We already got a fun time. story out of the way, right? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> well, a story that they've never, no one's heard. Let me, yeah, that's true. Not even like our closest friends. That's really. true. Yeah, that's just super like, oh, embarrassing. Oh. That's super embarrassing. What? <laughs> let, me, let me ask you a question though. On a real note, treasure hunting, fishing, diving, exploring, surviving, girlfriend, now wife videos. You've done a lot. I've been all over the place. What are you doing this year? Like, what's your actual plan? Like, for real, your actual plan besides the podcast? To be honest, this is pretty much all that I've thought about for this year. This is, this is what I've, I've kind of, I haven't really set goals because I have no idea what to expect. But I, I truly believe in this no, more I, than I think anybody will know. To, to answer your question, Brandon, I don't know. I want to make videos, but you've, I... You've been in the woods. Yeah. I mean, something that I really enjoy and something that I kind of never shared with any social media platform was obviously fishing, but that's something that I've grown up doing since I was a kid, but hunting, like I'm a crazy hunter, like love it. I cannot get my mind off of it. And when September comes around, dude, I'm just locked in and I don't want to think about anything else. So now going on two years, I have kind of, I kind of fall off in the winter as far as it's also hard for us, dude. It's so hard. Yeah. Like two or three days ago, I went and filmed three days in a row with Jake trying to make a video. How many videos out of those three days? Zero. People will never understand. No one will ever understand. They never understand. Like we truly work hard around weather, (laughs) around water temperatures, around, we got kicked out of a pond that definitely had a gun in it. Who kicked you out? The, I'm going to start a conspiracy right here. The um, Oh, you think it's another YouTuber that... <laughs> no, no, I think someone kicked you out, threw the gun in there. Oh, maybe. But it was just the guy that, uh, like a 
I don't want to say park ranger. It's not even that. It's like, it's a public park. He was some kind of guard. Yeah, but you can't. It was stupid. Anyways. You couldn't touch the water with a foreign object? They called object. the cops on us. Oh, that's great. You should have made a and video out of that. he was a subscriber. The cop was? <laughs> yes. I mean, at so this I was going to be like. What was this in Georgia, Columbus? This is in Columbus. At what point does a cop not know yeah, one of you true. guys in Columbus, Georgia? But, How are we looking on the cams there, Trav? We got a thumbs so, up. Um, Crushing, dude. Freaking. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> and banger podcast! Um, sorry for your ears. Sorry. So to be honest, I, I genuinely love diving and, and having fun, but I I, I don't want to say I lost my love for it, but <laughs> I we've done so much cool stuff that I haven't had something to spark my like fire other than this podcast. Yeah. Um, so I'm kind of like right now I'm in a... <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I, Sorry. this is where Tristan doesn't have headphones um, and it sounds like you just slurped right, my ear. right now. But um, <laughs> this is where, like, I'm in a weird headspace right now, have been for months, and I don't know what to do, bro. I just want to make some videos. I'm not laughing at good. your mental troubles. I'm just laughing because I can just hear you congested. He's like, are. hey, guys. <laughs> That's what you sound like. Um, when you did the little slurp, dude. I know. It was right in my ear. I'm sorry. It was like I was expecting a moist tongue to just <laughs> right in my ear, dude. So sorry. Yeah, it was a little much, um, man. But I, I truly enjoy hunting. The, the What sucks about it is uh, the aspect of being able to post it on YouTube. And you how, ever thought about... Thought about uh, <laughs> <laughs> I just, I'm telling you, bro, you gotta have these headphones. Yeah, but thought about I, I just, oh, switch with me. I just heard you go. <laughs> <laughs> let me let me hear. Let me hear. I gotta get okay, but I like the headphones. Okay, just give me. Let okay, me, let me have five minutes. <laughs> All right, I'm starting right now. <laughs> All right, I want these back at uh, which twenty seven plus five? Thirty <laughs> three. <laughs> I think right. Thirty two. Oh shit. Okay, now right, thirty three. Well, Okay. Yeah. All right. Wow, dude, it's just so dead without them. I feel like you're in a different realm whenever you have these. <clears> yeah, dude. Around. I gosh. Wow, the vibe has changed dramatically. <laughs> 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 you got to flip it. No, no, no. Flip the the left side, drop the drop, <laughs> drop it down. There no. <laughs> 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 what? Bro, I feel like an old man. All right, man. put those on. Put those on. Ladies and gentlemen, Yappy Chuan Chuan's in here. I told you, dude, it sets the whole vibe. I feel like we're doing a podcast. Hey, watch bro. this. Watch this. Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. what you did, bro. All right, on a, on a serious note. All right, I want that back in four minutes. Okay, so you're, you're talking about what I want to do this year. No, just like what your plans are. What are <laughs> things you want to try? Like, as, as creators... Because I'm sure some of the people watching this are creators or aspiring creators, or they're just fans, or maybe somehow they they're just stumbled just, upon this. They're just Could listening. you imagine that? They're like, dude, some dude wrecked Who his jet ski. <laughs> <laughs> some dude wrecked his jet ski. These guys don't live in the same state and they're hanging out. Okay. Um, before I forget. So what a lot of people don't know is uh, obviously losing my channel took a huge dude toll. we forgot about that yeah i didn't <laughs> so okay we'll, we'll talk way more in depth on this but losing my youtube channel that's i, I was almost at seven hundred thousand subscribers closing in on a million <clears throat> had viral videos going up or viral videos like i think the biggest problem with that is not only did you like lose like your base of subscribers but you lost your library yeah and i i lost dude i was like Go get her. I just hired my first camera guy. We were rolling. Yeah. And uh, I lost a lot of that fire that I used to have. And I don't know how to get that back, but I'm trying. Woo! All right. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Look at that live audience in the background. Woo! All right. We're totally kidding. Uh, we just realized our camera stopped at about 29 minutes. So every 29 just minutes. Just figure this out. Take a break. No um, big deal. So back to what we were saying. Lost the channel. It really took a toll on me mentally physically dude everything it was really hard um and i was up to 700,000 subscribers almost 700,000 subscribers and having to start over and regain that that following and that just everything the money it's everything it's rough. really really rough and uh you don't feel like you've come back from that yet no i i don't think i've gotten back to my full potential that fire that i had prior to losing the channel and just the 
the aspect of like get a little bit closer and just the aspect of like that's nice i just feel so far behind i don't know how to explain that no like i'm st- i feel like i'm starting the race and you guys have already finished if that makes sense i totally see where you're coming from it's like the only way i can relate to it is when i started my second channel and it's if somebody was like, yo, you can only post on this now. It's like, whoa, I have this one. Yeah. This is like my main one over here. Like, why yeah. would I just post on the second channel? It's like so. my bread and butter's over there. Yeah. I can't imagine. I mean, we've, you and I have talked about this a lot. Have, have you talked about this publicly? Really? No. Like in I've, this kind of sense? No. <clears throat> and I, I, no one, no one knows. I don't even like, dude, I've. <sighs> You've been God. in a dark place with that. I've been in a super dark place as far as just mentally i i was the type of person that like i i didn't really i was so like what's the anxiety what's that what's depression you know i feel like for sure i feel like for a man you're supposed to be strong and you know you can't be weak and a sign of weakness is this or that right but the past like since i lost my channel i've experienced the lowest of lows and dude i for people that don't understand to where I was, I worked four years, my four years of my life, putting everything on the line. I dropped yeah. out of school. Everything. Yeah. Yeah. You gave up every opportunity you had to chase this. So one. And as did we all, we yeah. all did it together. That was kind of like the beauty of it. So, and, um, and so it's just, it, I've, it's been rough. Um, and not, a, no one knows that no one, because it's Instagram, YouTube, it's just the highlight reel. And I feel like sometimes when, maybe this is where we are able to be a little bit more real. Yeah, I was going to say real. That. I was going to say Because that. I was in a dark place. Like, one of the most awesome times of my life, when I, right before I was about to get married, probably a month prior, I had, like, dude, I was going through it. And yeah. no one knows about that. I think you, you and, like, maybe two other friends. But we didn't talk about it during yeah, you, you didn't let me know during. You kind of let me know after. Yeah, like I was yo. just like high functioning anxiety and depression. Yeah, and inside of it, um, God, we're all over the place. But inside of it, you know, I've come out of slightly come out of it in a, in a way. I feel like I'll always deal with it. I feel like I never had it, or maybe I just didn't notice it. And then you finally have that breakthrough, which is not a good breakthrough, but that you have anxiety and you have depression. And I think it's something that will always, the enemy will always try to attack you. And I think it's okay. It's okay to be sad. It's okay to be upset. It's okay to hurt. And a lot of men need to know that. I feel like. No, I agree with you. You know, what's crazy too. It seems like as we get older, we're dealing with like really weird emotions, emotions. Yeah. And circumstances too, because bro, one of the things, talk about anxiety, <clears throat> I don't, and like, I do want to hop on a, hop, a happy topic yeah. here soon, but like, this is just being just real. Quick. Like, dude, I've got to accomplish so many wonderful things, as we both have. Dude, buying this house, this is like the milestones. Like, once you get your house paid for, your vehicle's paid for, I always make the jokes like, once I get everything paid for, I can just get a job at Publix and maintain, bro. <laughs> I always make that joke. But it's so true because you never know like when this roller coaster could end or slow down. And I felt that. Well, yeah, no, you felt the yeah, your Dude, tracks broke, we, dog. We we have t- always talked about that. YouTube could end tomorrow. Yeah. YouTube could end tomorrow, whatever. Yeah. For years, we're always worried. Uh, when you when you like when my wife when I met my wife and met her parents, what what's your backup? Yeah. I don't have a backup. Oh god. I'm all in. That's never a good conversation. You know what I mean? Have. Yeah. And a lot of people don't understand that. And and I will say my, uh, what are they? In-laws. My in-laws now. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> um, they did not see it at first. Yeah. And finally bought in and realized that YouTube and, and being a social, an, an influencer, whatever you want to call it, is like a real job. Dude, the only person of age that I have met that really understands that before getting to meet a YouTuber or whatever was Shiner Sam. Yeah. That's the only person that has like understood what it is. But so I I was all in. I had, I was no turning back. I I 
to be honest, I always said, oh, I'll go back and finish school. Because we, me and you both literally have a semester in college to finish and have a degree. Ain't it something? But I, why? Why go do that? Let me ask you a question. I don't think I could finish either, though. <laughs> if, if you've been gone for a certain amount of time, does you, more time get added on to how many semesters no, you owe? No, no, no. You, I feel you like have, it should. Like, you got to no, go back and take so remedial math. No. <laughs> <laughs> like, we got to do a refresher no, no, no. for this um, guy, bro. So yeah, you're telling me, bro. All right. Over one, so many one years. One million likes on our first podcast. Tristan and I will get our degrees. No, I won't. One million likes? Okay, one million likes, yeah. But that's not happening. Wait, for real? Go back to school. One million likes? We could retire. <laughs> <laughs> Tris is like, I believe in this podcast so much. One really million do. likes is like, yeah, sure. Whatever. Make it happen. Then. <laughs> do it. <laughs> do it. <laughs> Senior Bass, do it. Do it. <laughs> um, Dude. Oh, God. This is amazing. All right. All right. All right. Yeah. Balled in <clears throat> fully. No turning back. I did. I had no Dude, other plan. Here you are. Can I tell you something, Tristan Yaptenko? First of all. Can you spell your name very quickly for the people? Y-A-P-T and G-C-O. Oh, man. It's just so many letters just Dude. thrown in there, And they bro. don't even know my middle names. Yeah. I have two middle There's names. There's multiple. Anyway. All right. Can I tell you something? What? Tell me something. Friend of friend. Friend of friend. Brothers. I know you don't have headphones on, so you're not in this experience yeah, like I'm I not, am. But it's okay. I really think this year is your comeback year. And I think... Maybe, maybe... <laughs> With the help of you guys, if you share this video, just give them a call to action. If you share this video and like and subscribe, you too will be able to help me pay my bills. That is the crowd clapping. Wow. You guys are awesome. Woo. Thank you, Trav. Um, <laughs> no, I like literally driving down here. I was the first time I've been excited about filming. Yeah. And not necessarily what we're going to be doing in the daytime, but filming this podcast i'm truly excited i feel like a little piece of that that puzzle that you're I'm turning missing. a new leaf my friend yeah i feel like we both are and dude, uh, i tried something different this year it's not going great so far <laughs> wait what <laughs> dude i tried something different this year what i have a bunch of plans this year so do you want to ask me or you want me to just yeah you should probably just keep going you know, just just ask me so what, what's your plans for you know I was hoping you'd ask. <laughs> so here's my plans, dude. So I, I, if you guys watch my videos, you know, there's been a lot of brand deals. There's just so much that I'm trying to do. That's like bigger money stuff. And to be completely honest with you, it's way, <clears throat> it's way better financially to fund it with brand deals. So there's been a bunch of brand deals, but the problem with that is the end of 2021. So like November and December, dude, I was so swamped. And every December I try to, every YouTuber does, tries to film as much as possible because that's the big check. You could have a mediocre year all year long and you can fix that year in December. True. True. So. <clears throat> Never well, experienced it, but true. <laughs> I've heard. <laughs> I know it's true. <laughs> I, uh, so I was in a position every single year. I always try to do like really big stuff. Uh, in December, <clears throat> frying pan tower, absolute failure. Oh, I yeah, wish I it was better. Was go crazy. I wish it was better. It was and dude, a guy two weeks prior no, to you. No, was it? He month? was there after me. No, I just took a month to edit it. Uh, yeah, I took a month to edit it. Yeah, he went. He there posted right after it. You. Ten Boom. million views. Yeah. Trending page. All this crazy stuff. I posted. Three days after mm -hmm. when I actually get it edited. Which back in the day, bro, <clears throat> YouTube's changed a little bit. But back in the day, boom, it would have been crazy too. No, for sure. But it's just, it was just a defeating moment because I planned that out <sighs> and there was so much. But anyway, let me get back on track here. So uh, I've been swamped with brand deals, which is a good problem I to have. I remember to freaking look at the Right. I'm, I, this is my guy right here. And I guess I could look at this one, but this is my guy right here. I've, I've been, I was swamped with brand deals, which is a good problem to have. The problem was I was making videos for the brand deals. Yeah, I've, I've I, I was playing that. catch up, dude. dude. I was playing catch up. Right now, family channel. All the family channel videos because fresh because you have brand deals and well this I need is to be better at that but this yeah. is this is why I fix that problem so I was like well I want to there it is wow. at a baby let's get it to him all right 
So I wanted to be better. Uh, be better. I wanted to be better. That's and nice. here we are. I love that. We're being so much better. I love that. <laughs> <laughs> that was like aggression in that. All right, dude. Let me finish this thought Go. so we can move on. I took January off, not from film, not from filming, but from posting. But from posting. And everyone knows December's the best year. January's what? <laughs> <laughs> Exactly, dude. <laughs> exactly. You want to know how much money I made? Bleep this out. I'm just <laughs> you don't have to. Cause not a lot. <laughs> uh, so anyway, I took all January off from fil- or posting, but I filmed. And I was in Hawaii. So I was trying to do like big series stuff. Yeah. And so I filmed all month. And then now February, I have a month of content. So I'm actually a month ahead. So if I want brand deals or whatever... Like when I called you, when, I, when you called me and I was all soapy, yeah, I was yeah, doing yeah. a brand deal. But I'm tying it to a video that I'm stoked about, yeah. that my viewers can be stoked about. So I'm excited about that. I've got like projects for each month. And then a couple people I'm working with keep jacking up my problems, bro. bro. Jacking them up. Some, some brands are freaking sick. Some brands, not going to say no names. I'm not talking about brands. Oh, who are you talking about? I'm talking about people, bro. Oh, who the people? I'm relying on some folks. Who? That are just giving me false information. What information? It would be such a banger podcast if I just called them out right now. Dude, call them bitches out. Can we say bitches? <laughs> I just did. Just did. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I can't yet. I can't yet. But there's just a lot of like timeline issues. and Bleep it out. What's going on? Can I tell you? Yeah, just tell I'll, me. I'll, I'll, I'll. No, just bleep me out. Well, I'm going to mute both of us. Okay. Okay, so we're back. Yeah, dude, those guys. I was kidding. <laughs> I don't know. It's just throwing a wrench in my plans. And now you're here, though. So we could actually film a lot of cool stuff. Yeah. We just got to figure out what you wanted to film. I was kind of like leading you into that. Like, oh, I want to do survival what? videos. And I'll be like, oh, yeah. wow, bro. Like, let's go live. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm, I'm still stuck in the... Um, I'm really... I have one idea. Let me ask you a... I really have a, a good idea. real question. Like, boom. Let me ask you a real question boom. before... You expand on that idea. Oh, you got to talk okay. close to your mind. Yeah, okay. here you go. Do, are you filming things that make you happy or are you filming things that you think are going to bring you money this year? You want me to be honest? I want you to be. Dude, yes. I don't know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> uh, neither. <laughs> yeah, I, um, I, I, I do want to be happy. For sure. That's that's what we were talking about with the hunting thing. I don't, I'm in a rock and a hard place. I don't know what to do. Like, I really want to film hunting. That is the, the, what I enjoy the most. But I know I cannot post that on YouTube. Why and don't you sucks. be a part of a specific paid program called Guggen Uncut? Because Links in the description. We get 10% off use code Jiggin with Tristan. Hey, just use code Banger. <laughs> banger. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what I'm, I'm, I don't know. I don't know what, is it an option? Have you talked to the boys? Uh, slightly. I slightly talked to Flair. I think it, I, it definitely could be an option. And dude, I rock bucks like all the time. I'm going to be honest with you. I can't say it. Yeah. We gotta be quiet. Um, (sighs) so am I going to be filming stuff? If a YouTuber says they're not going to film stuff that makes them more money, they're a liar. I don't care. I'll, I'll point, I'll look at them in the face. Brandon Jordan, you're a liar. You're a liar. I know a fact you're boo. a liar. We need boo. a boo button. Yeah, boo. we need a boo button. I, all YouTube creators are trying to find that most viral video. And you have a lot of YouTube, I don't want to be the YouTube creator that is just jumping on another bandwagon. Mm. I wish we could find something that is our own. Kind of like we did what we did with Treasure. Let me pitch. With me, you, and Jake. Let me pitch you an idea. Pitch me that mother. I'm winding up right now. Okay. Fingers on the laces. I was about to say, (laughs) I don't know where else those fingers might be. (laughs) Fingers on the laces. We get deep. Fingers on the laces, bro. Okay. And then I have something I want to talk about. I was going to say something about, dude, a man with true belief in the podcast tapes his whole drink. $3 $3 worth of duct tape on that drink just so you won't know what he's drinking. And I guarantee you, if you look in the comments, a lot of people got it right. 
a lot of people know exactly what that is. There's right. really no hiding what that is. But, <laughs> dude, I can hear you go, <laughs> swallow that. <laughs> God, that was horrible. If you could only smell this. But this is why I believe in it because <clears throat> at one point, when this podcast goes boom, pew, there's gonna be there's gonna be little cans like this. And we just talked about brand deals and how it's like so rough, and we're just like we're getting sponsored drinks ASAP. Yeah, untaped. You, you guys only knew how much we got paid for this podcast. <laughs> Zero. <laughs> uh, speaking of the podcast, great segue. Thanks for tuning into what I'm. Forty nine minutes thirty eight seconds. We're crushing it. So. I want to tell you a couple facts about the desk. You're out. <laughs> you were talking about pitching. Ba- baseball reference. Yeah. I'm going to try to hit the boo button. <laughs> nope. That was sci-fi. <laughs> I'm going to try to hit Wait. the boo button. <laughs> that was sci-fi. It was... So that that's sucks. creepy. All right. Anyway, I uh, want to tell you some cool facts about the desk. Okay. It's dope. <laughs> no. Uh... Yeah, the sounds all the way turned down. Oh, that was applause. That's applause. Turn it down. It's way too loud. You're, yeah. you're killing it. They're going to be like, please take the sound <laughs> bar away from Tristan. All right. uh, so one thing, uh, the desk is we wanted it to look like kind of an old scuba shack. Kind of. By the way, you guys can't tell, but there's a whole fish tank back here. Yeah. This desk like moves around to where it's like an editing station. And then it's also like the podcast form. This is obviously the podcast form. Yeah. But... One thing that's really cool is all of the scuba tanks on the front of this were actually real scuba tanks. Real. They were, half. they were just decommissioned uh, because they passed the like date. Mm-hmm. So what's kind of cool is these tanks have probably mostly been in Florida, but I'm sure they've been on some really cool oh, adventures. Wow, I didn't even think of that. Dude, all, I left all the markings everything they are untouched as you see them is how i got them if there's one right here that i can see that has multiple stickers on it and it's i didn't even think of that yeah no 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 so um i really wish i could see which one you're talking about because there's a yellow one over here it's a blue one that says oh it has the sticker down the front mm -hmm. yeah yeah there's stickers that's really cool why have we never put stickers on our tanks well there's a lot of reasons brandon shoots his uh, yeah, that was a, such a mistake, dude. So much money. Did not know how expensive those things were. <laughs> I did not know. And it was mid... Wait, I don't think we can see say the sickness word on the podcast. Yeah, we're not going to say this. But it was mid-season for that sickness. And then couldn't get scuba tanks. Who would have thought that would have been a problem? Anything, but... Um. But anyways, the desk is really, really cool. It was something that Brandon came to me and was like, dude, I got this idea. I pitched. I came, I came, I had a little bit of the like scuba tank thing, right? No, we definitely worked on it together. I mean, because dude, I was out in a parking lot. My family was eating and I was, we were so hyped up on this. It was probably like the third or fourth conversation about the podcast. And you were like, dude, but I got the set. But also a lot of it was... Just the guys who built it. Yeah. Like, by the way, these dudes, I only got in contact with them because they used to cut the grass to my property and they, I was the last property they cut the grass to. And then they started, uh, this crazy company. Long story short, I just randomly got in touch with these guys. It was like a miracle. And I kind of told them an idea. We drew some stuff on a paper in this crazy shop. And then what would you say, Travis, a month, two, couple months, maybe couple months later a few details and i gave them all these scuba tanks whole which they cut in half it takes about a day to cut each scuba tank you really don't know how freaking thick they are so thick they stop 50 cal rounds bro thick (laughs) (laughs) it was incredible (laughs) um but they absolutely crushed it and uh, it was a big surprise to me a big surprise to tristan we're still gonna get like a bunch of stuff on the walls this is literally tristan got in Four hours ago now. Yeah. And we did the podcast together. How are we looking over there, Trav? We got the thumbs up. Crushing it. Crushing it. That's going to be a t-shirt. Crushing it? Yeah. With the banger boys? Yeah. Are we the banger boys now? We did we just coin that term? We are the banger boys. Ladies and gentlemen, banger boys. Well. You got anything else you want to say? Dude, I have a ton to say, but 
being how I only have a week here. No, I have two weeks, but um, we're trying to get as much content as possible for this podcast to be able to bring you more podcasts. I mean, our goal right now is to have two podcasts a week for the rest of the year. But if there is a chance that we could bring you guys more content, of course, we're going to try yeah, to do that. So absolutely. also this thing is mobile. We're not just going to be in the studio. Yeah, so that, that's another thing. We're bringing guests in. We're going to be able to travel and do this podcast. We are flying people in. Tris and I have created a budget together where we are going to spend dollars on getting we've people already, in we've the already studio. Spent, we've already spent some dollars. And by we, Tristan swiped the card on that one. <laughs> I don't know what kind of flight he picked out, but it was probably first class. Sounded very expensive. Yeah, so the, the guests that might be on... One of the the next one, <laughs> dude. I don't. We're gonna we listen to this. Make sure this audio is straight. But could be on the next podcast. It really could. Because should we give him a little hint? No. Yeah, a little hint. No. Not, it's not gonna say anything. No way. What? No way. Why not? No way. I'm giving him a little hint. You can't. <laughs> <laughs> He's muted now. He's okay, muted. Yeah, he probably gonna... sounds in the distance. Okay. We're we're both unmuted. What do you want? I was just I was just Hold on, now we're now we're unmuted. All right, go for it. Go for it. All I was gonna say is the guest that's coming on is one of our good buddies. We've dude known him for a long time. Let me put it this way. He's a heavy hitter. He might be the heaviest hitter. I mean, not in the physical sense, but Dude, I'm telling you, if you want a banger guest, this is this is the this one. This is a banger guess. Tristan would not ever swipe his card for someone that he didn't believe in. And this guy is a good, good bet. Freaking love this guy. This guy's a good bet. And he hasn't been on YouTube in a while. <laughs> oh, I think we're giving way too many hands. It's Danny Duncan. Ladies and gentlemen, Danny Duncan. <laughs> <laughs> that would be kind of sick. Um, yeah, it's but not, on a serious it's not note, Danny Duncan. Very but- <laughs> first podcast of many. I'm super excited. Brandon's super excited. We have big dreams and aspirations for this channel and for this audio listening. Dude, I don't even know. Can I give them a topic that we're going to run on our next podcast if it's not our guest? I have in my notes under the name Tristan. (laughs) Let me pull my notes out. Dogs, fake balls. (laughs) So (laughs) we're going to get in the uh, fake ball (laughs) dog topic on our next pod. Trav, how are we looking? Four minutes? Cool. Let's go ahead and wrap this up. <laughs> um, wow. Uh, you got anything you want to say? We're, we're running out of time. Quick. Have, we're counting uh, seconds, dude. I have uh, one of my topics says bachelor trip, eight guys, one shower. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, you're going to have to tune into the next podcast. <laughs> it was absolutely incredible. Thank you guys so much for watching, uh, viewing, listening, wherever, wherever you may be. you got it. Uh, yeah, we have no clue. This, sh- this will be available at some point on every streaming platform that exists. We're always going to focus on video though, because the YouTube background, uh, so we want it to be more like a show, so, but, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Guests yeah. coming on soon. More patch class coming to you more, very soon. More Pod- podcasts. <laughs> more patch class. We're raw soon. here, baby. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for you guys are watching amazing. and viewing and listening to another banger podcast. As always, Jiggle with Jay, Yappy Chuan Chuan. We really got to figure out how to close the this banger thing out. boys. <laughs> We're out of here, guys. Thank you so much. We love you. Please subscribe. We're still on. We're still on. That was. Incredible. That was sick. Please subscribe. Yeah, like and subscribe.